bring them sounds at one time. I'm up early in the morning huh? to get the Skrilla. Skrilla. Blue face pillar, face pillar. the blade dealer. Uh. Make a nigga forfeit, yeah. cause I'm the realest. Hey. Niggas talking short shit, nah. I need a million. Uh. Big stepper, Big step. yeah, bitch I be stepping. Steppin'. Cooling kit with the flip switch, bitch that's the weapon. <laughs> no drama. drama. Welcome to New York Giants Full Access. Nice legend, bring them sounds at one time. I'm Art, and we got you. So that's it, man. Go purchase Big Pass Sports Talk merch and support the family, man. And welcome to Big Pass Sports Talk. Thank you for your support. What's going on YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, all platforms? Welcome to another episode of New York Giants Full Access. With your boy Big Passports talking today's subjects. Could Saquon Barkley really go sign with the Philadelphia Eagles? And another great running back, Antiki Barber, warns Saquon Barkley about going to the Philadelphia Eagles. Now, let's talk about Saquon Barkley, the whole Saquon Barkley saga. We all know that. Uh, there's the reports that Saquon Barkley more than likely would not be with the New York Giants after this um, after free agency. Um, looks like he does not want to accept any contract that we have offered to him for the past two off seasons. So looks like Saquon Barkley will have another jersey on more than likely if he can find more on the market than what we're offering. So reports are coming out that that's pretty much a done deal. Now, I'm not mad at Saquon Barkley for wanting to leave and go get more money. If there's more money on the market, more man, go feed your family, go do what you have to do. You've been through so much turmoil here with the New York Giants, so I'm not mad at you wanting to go find the bag. But if you go to the Philadelphia Eagles, that's going to be a problem. <laughs> that's going to be a serious problem if you go to the Philadelphia Eagles. Now, I was going to root for you regardless. But if you go put on that puke green with that stupid wing on your helmet and go over there with A.J. Brown, Jalen Hurts, Smith, Nick Sirianni, good Lord, Hugh Laurie, all those guys over there, it's going to make me sick to my stomach that you will leave this franchise and go play for the Philadelphia Eagles. Now, the rumors are true. There is some mutual interest between the two teams. And if he goes to the Philadelphia Eagles, I believe he will have one heck of a season, seasons with the Eagles, especially with that offensive line over there. I know Jason Kelsey just retired, but they still got Lane Johnson, Mayata, Cam Jurgens, a lot of people over there. So I think he will shine going over there with the Eagles, but that would totally sicken my stomach. And would make me look at Saquon Barkley a, a little different because, man, I, I, I don't even know if I like him anymore <laughs> if he goes to the Eagles. But it does make sense uh, that the Eagles will come up because they do offer him to get revenge back on the Giants two games a year. Uh, they do have one of the better offensive lines in the game, so they will open up some holes for him. Hell, they did it for Swift. They did it for Miles Sanders. I'm quite sure they could do it for Saquon Barkley. And I believe he spent some time in Philadelphia as a kid growing up, so it does make sense. I think the Texans is the landing spot. It, I, I really think the Texans are going to press hard for him, and they'll be the one to give him that big contract. But let's see how a former great New York Giants running back feels about this whole situation in Tiki Barber. The fact that Saquon would even contemplate going to play for that team in Philadelphia 
is insulting to his giant history and legacy. Saquon very well not be a New York Giant. I know that Joe Shane is having conversations, but it just doesn't feel like it's going to work out. Go to Baltimore. Go to Houston. Go to L.A. Chargers. Do not go to the Philadelphia Eagles. Because if you do, that appreciation and respect and reverence that we all have for you, Saquon, will be lost. It'll be gone. We want to still respect and love him. Mm. If he goes if he goes to Houston and he's down there with C.J. Stroud and they do some great stuff and, hell, he even wins a championship, we'll feel happy for him. Yeah. No matter what happens when he does in Philadelphia, we will hate it. Don't let... The nonsense, Saquon. Don't let the Howard Eskins of the world and his 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 traitor son who's going down the road <laughs> influence you to go into the cesspool of the Philadelphia Eagles. Go kiss ass. You're going to turn into one of those people that we hate, yeah. and we don't want that. Yeah. We don't. Like, we'll respect you, but we'll hate you, and that's not a good thing. Your jersey, that 2-6 that we see all over the stadium, it won't be worn anymore. Gone. It'll be gone. Gone. It'll be burned, burned. In, some, in some cases. Yeah. Do not, without any doubt, go to Philadelphia. All right, man. Y'all heard Tiki Barber, man. And I totally agree with just about everything he said, man. Go anywhere. Go to the Bears. Go to the Texans. Go to the Ravens. Go to the Dolphins. Go, go. Man, go anywhere. Go to the Chiefs. I don't even, I don't like the Chiefs very much, but go to the Chiefs. Go. Man, go anywhere. But the Eagles, the Cowboys, the Jets, go anywhere but those three places, and you'll be all right in my book, man. I don't care. You can go anywhere but those three places. I cannot stand the Eagles or the Cowboys, and I cannot stand the Jets. And I wouldn't care if you went to the Commanders because we're going to beat you up two times a year and we still going to like you. <laughs> but do not go to the Eagles. Do not go to the Cowboys. And do not go to the Jets. The Jets are going to tarnish your legacy. The Eagles is going to piss people off to the highest extreme. And the Cowboys are going to piss people off. So you go to the Eagles, you're going to get your jersey burned. I promise you that. You go to Cowboys, you're going to get some side eyes. And you go to the Jets, you're going to get some laughter. But, oh my goodness, don't go to the Eagles, bro. Uh, man, that, 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 that would be tremendously horrible for you and the New York Giants. For you to go to the Eagles, man, they're going to... Man, they gonna tear you down over here in New York, man. You go to the Eagles, bro. But I know you don't care, man. You gotta do what you gotta do for you. Uh, this is a fun little segment. Uh, the rumors are true, though. Him and the Eagles do have uh, mutual interests. So we'll see what happens. Uh, starting Monday, free agency. Uh, I think the tampering period starts Monday, I believe. So. You may hear some things come this Monday, and I know for sure so you're going to hear some things this coming Wednesday on the 13th where free agency starts. So be tuned in to Big Pass Sports Talk, um, New York Giants full access for your free agency needs. And then, you know, I got your draft needs as well. So hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that big blue join button, and talk your talk with Big Pass Sports Talk and join the Big Blue crew. And go copy some merch, man. I seen you guys done bought a couple of hats. You done bought a couple of shirts. Let's get some hoodies. Let's get some aprons. Let's get some posters. Let's get some coffee mugs. Whatever you got to get, let's get it. But until the next episode, you know what it is, man. Peace.
Welcome to New York Giants for Access.